Nomax water jet. The first thing you'll do is come around behind it. And there's a water pipe. If it's sticking straight out, it's off. But you're going to turn it until it's pointing straight up in the air. The second thing you're going to do, you're going to come on the main pump unit. And there's a big red switch. You're going to turn that to the on position. You're going to see it start up right here. The next switch you're going to turn is here on the computer. Turn that on. And then the last switch is going to be on the computer itself. In the top right corner, that's the power from the computer. And then and this just lifts up. And then you're going to give it time to boot up. Go. Okay, on the main screen, you're going to see icons on the left. Uh, one of them is OMAX Make. That's where you're going to actually control the water jet. So I'm going to double click on OMAX Make. It's going to bring up this screen every time. And this image, it's just a, like a, a practice image for the, for the water jet. So to open up my program, I have it on a flash drive. I'm going to, I'm going to lift up the lid again. And then I'm just going to put it in one of the USB slots here on the computer. And so when I go to File, Open, Change Path Setup, it's right right now. It's just it's just giving me a node on rotation scale. I'm not going to worry about that right now. I'm going to go to Open, and on the left side you can click your drive. So I know my flash drive is E drive, and here are all my different uh, programs that I've made. And if I just pick one of these, like, uh, let me pick this compass. And so that's going to give me the image. It's going to show me what it's going to look like over here. It kind of gives you the scale and everything. And down here is where you change your material. Right click on it. Over here on the tab. And then you can scroll down through the different materials. Just tell it what it is. So just for example, I'm going to pick aluminum 6061. Thickness. This is where you type in the thickness of the material. Say it's a quarter inch, I'm going to put 0.25. Tool offset, you adjust that in case in, in case you need to adjust it, you would, you would change it because your, your water jet's cutting thicker or thinner than what you think it is. So our offset right now is 13 thousandths. You can, you can set a rotation here and you can also scale it down. Say it's, say it's twice as big as I want it to be right now, I can put 0.5 in the scale. And if I want to rotate it for any reason, I can rotate it any direction you want. So it kind of gives me a preview view of the size and where it's going to rotate to. So 90 degrees was over here. So if I press OK, it gives me another it gives me another note about scale factors. Just press OK. And this is where you'd actually cut it is on this screen. Thank you.